Barley is to beer what the grape is to wine. It's the body and soul of beer, adorning ales and lagers with not just alcohol, but their colour, their texture, their sweetness and their beautiful bubbles. Honey, warm bread, espresso, chocolate, nuts and caramel are just some of the flavours brought to beer by British barley. Barley gives soft mouths their sweetness, pale ales and lagers their glorious golden hue, and porters and stouts their full-bodied velvety smoothness. So we cut the grains in half and this is what would have actually, in the days of the old corn exchanges, this would have made a, 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 a maltster interested in buying the grain or not. Now we have uh, scientific machines in laboratories but this is the old tried and tested way. And as you can see we're looking for a nice starchy white finish. The majority of those grains are and they will continue to to modify as uh, as the crop gets riper. And it's on its final journey now to the malt house to be turned into malt, converted into malt, which is then all ready for the brewer to turn into beer. So what you've got is green malt. As you can see, it's no longer barley. We've uh, been malting this for nine days and during that period we've allowed the barley to quietly germinate and through that natural process the starches have been modified so that now we can rub them out as a smooth paste and you can see that when that goes off to the brewer the brewer is going to be able to mash and convert that starch to sugar. Half a dozen varieties of kilned and roasted barley here. All these um, varieties will go into making different styles of beer. Another load of local barley to be delivered to a local brewery. It only takes four things to make beer. You think of all the diversity, all the different kinds of beers in the world, and all the different kinds of beers that, that we brew at the brewery, and all of that comes from just four things. It comes from malted barley, it comes from water, well we've got plenty of that in Cornwall, and um, it comes from hops and yeast. But barley is the soul of it. You know, we're growing a, a barley that's living, and blimey, we can go out in the evening and um, sit in the local pub, uh, not just farmers drinking it, holds everybody from all walks of life. Barley is one of Britain's national heroes. Barley is the soul of beer.